Hey everyone, just wanted to thank you all for uh, submitting your videos for Children's Church. Um, I'm excited for us to do this episode. Uh, we got a lot of great kids that are just wanting to share their uh, favorite Bible stories. So uh, just remember, if you want to submit a video to me of your kids sharing their favorite Bible story, uh, just email me at parker at easternoaks.org. So I will see you guys, I will see you guys Sunday. All right, y'all. Bye. Okay, Ava, who is your favorite Bible character and why? My, my favorite Bible character is, is, is Jesus because he has the Spirit of God. Philip, who is your favorite Bible character and why? My favorite Bible character is Jonah it's because... because because he was in he was in a big whale that swallowed them when he was going on a boat and then he was he was in there for three days and three nights. And but he was alive because Jesus saved him. Alright. And that's it. Thank you guys. Okay. My favorite Bible story is the story of Jonah and the whale. And it starts off where God asked Jonah to do to go to the city of Nineveh and preach to the cruel, evil people there. So, and he didn't want to go. So after that, he got on this really big boat, tried to run away from God, and then a huge storm came, and all the sailors were freaking out. Were like, "What do we do? What do we do?" So Jonah said, "Just throw me off of the boat," and they did that. And the seas went calm, and there was blue sky and everything and then after that a huge whale just came and swallowed him and he was in the stomach of the whale for three days and three nights and he ended up after those three days and three nights on the island of Nineveh and that teaches you that you don't want to run away from God either you do it the easy way or you do it the hard way um Hello, my name is Gideon, and I am going to be talking about Gideon and how he was and how he saved the Israelites. Okay, so the so the Israel the Israel the Israelites would disobey God, and the back the other guy the um and the enemy took over their crops. The enemy took over the crops, and um, Gideon, what God asked Gideon to to help to save the people, and Gideon tested God. God proved how. How he would always be there. How he would always be there. That's right. And um, so he, so God took away lots of his men and left him with only a hundred. Three hundred. Three hundred men, and Gideon gave them a jar with torches and a and a trumpet, and they would and. Gideon went to sneak up on the um on the on the army on the army and one of them said that their that, that their dream and it was a big loaf of bread came and destroyed um their the army the army and they, and they said that would be Gideon and so and so gay they had attacked them and they and um they didn't attack they surrounded them right they surrounded them and then what they do and they and they skate and they blew their trumpets and smashed their jars with toys and they scared them and then they made them fight each other that's right they attacked each other and what happened in the end they won hooray so god used gideon to save the people that's right. Why do you like this? Why did you like the story? 
Why is the story of Gideon your favorite story in the Bible? Because it's about someone named Gideon. And mm -hmm. your name is? Gideon. Awesome.